Previously on Danganronpa RBG. I believe them. You believe them? Understood. However, please do not engage them in battle. They may be strong, but they're certainly not showing us to be. They have bested me in a duel. <laughs> I think you just broke him. And now back to the video. Welcome back to Maple Walks Across the Same Map for 20 Minutes. Well, that didn't work, but we got to see Biakia play. We also got some bronze armor, but neither Makoto or Yasuhiro can actually wear it, so brilliant. Okay. Do we need to go to Moonlight Town next? I don't remember. Where do we go? You know, Makoto Chi. Have you saved your game yet? Have I saved my what? Um, never mind. Forget I said anything, dude. <laughs> I'll save it anyway. Thanks, Yasuhiro. You're a true pal. How many flipping maps are there? This is so long. I love it. I can't believe how long the card is. Oh. Huh? Oh, it's him? <laughs> Lovely to know that I am indeed dealing with a couple of slugs. Hey, you're the prince. It seems you haven't lost your eyeballs. Maybe this is just a little bit worth it after all. Dude, what are you doing at- Do not call me that. How about- How about I pull out the entire arsenal of the kingdom instead of just myself? Ah! Wait, yourself? You heard me. I'm going out to investigate this course. Really? Don't hold yourself in such high esteem, peasant. I didn't decide to do this myself. The king sent me. Oh, so the king told you to investigate? But I thought he wouldn't do anything about it. When did he say that he wasn't going to do anything about it? If investigating these ominous happenings were just put into the hands of- Or put into the hands of just powerless drones like yourselves, nothing would ever get done. Powerless drones? Yes, you even said it yourself, you two aren't fighters. All you have is rope and a stick, so I've heard from the knights. If the world was put into the hands of you two drones, we would all be doomed, obviously. Freaking really? So you're just gonna go all by yourself then? Never did I say I was going to go alone. On two conditions. I will allow you to come to accompany me. Really? You'll go with us? That's great, what an honor. Yes. On the grounds that, one, you never use that disrespectful term, DUDE, <laughs> towards me ever again. I'm sure we can do that, yes, Ahirokun. Sure. And two, you must first prove yourself, yourselves worthy. How? What do we need to do? A duel, possibly to the death. Yo, this theme is so epic! What? To the death? Possibly. <laughs> but... On guard, ready yourselves. Ah! Shit, man, this music I love. Ooh, I try and sleep him. Damn. Let's try and burn him. Haha, -ha, counter attack. Suck on that, Tagami. Let's try and sleep him again because that would be really great. Thunder Sword! Oh shit! Oh, okay, it doesn't actually do more damage, it's just a fancy element attack. Sharing of Hope. Shit. Please don't die. Shit, Makoto. Ha ha ha, Byakuya, you missed. I'm actually shocked you can even do an ounce of damage with that pathetic stick and inaccurate stone. However, despite your proficiency, you lack proper weapons. My sword will, get, will gladly continue to demonstrate that to you. Oh no, I'm worried about what that means for us. Shielded himself! Shit!
Oh no, yes, hero, don't die, please. You're my healer. Oh, I can't get over this song. Oh no! <laughs> what do I do now? Blizzard sword! Come on, no, you gotta live, Makoto! Oh no, he's gonna die. Shit. Damn. Here we are again, fighting the Akiya because I died the first time, whoops. I'm gonna burn him first, and we're gonna attack him. And yes, if is not gonna die this time, because that would be great. Attack. <laughs> Whoo, that was close. Oh, come on. No, damn it. Ah, how does ah, how do I know when he's going to do that? Oh no, yes, a hero. Please don't die again. Damn. Please evade, please evade, please evade. Damn it. Shit. So it seems your abilities aren't as mind-numbingly terrible as I thought. However, I think it's time we end this, don't you think? Oh no! Oh no! Shit! Hmm. Damn! We're dead, we're dead, we're dead, we're dead, we're- Stop whining. You know perfectly well that what I just used was a limit break. Limit break? <laughs> it's the Professor Leighton theme! Ah. <laughs> oh. Like, I love this theme, but I didn't expect it to start playing. <laughs> what I'm saying is, I suppose you two, not as worthless as I thought commoners, are worthy of accompanying me. Really? Nice. However, know that I will only- th that I will accept only the finest treatment for having to go with you. I'm not expecting much, but I'd better get your best. Yeah, sure, hi- Quit calling me that, or I'll be shamed for going with you commoners. But, dude, we don't even know what to call you, then. Wait, I know, how about- Prince your highness chi! In all my years of living, I have never seen such a complete idiot in my life. What did I just say? Something about gardens, right? <laughs> Ugh, fine. I will let you to address me by my given name. Maybe we should introduce ourselves then. My name is Makoto Naegi. I'm Yasuhiro Hagakuri, the shaman at Hope Village. Take it easy, yeah, I know I will. Name is Byakuya Tagami. Cool, and I'm gonna call you Byakuya chi! That's enough for the introductions. Let's just get moving, shall we? Understood. Biaki has joined your- Oh, I mean, you have joined Biaki's party. I get the sinking feeling I'm gonna forget he hates being called that. Oh well. 
Hey, now we have Tagami, and Makoto is almost dead, and Yasuhiro is dead. Brilliant. Okay. Miyaki is level one. Great. What do you have? Swordplay. Counter. Very counter sword. Movement break. Critical strike. Tags. Can cause flinch. Oh, that sounds cool. What equipment do you have? Oh, I can give you the bronze armor. Definitely pick up the bronze armor. Good. The crown prince of the Tagami kingdom, his cold attitude as well as his high and mighty presence make him quite exhausting to be around. Despite this, he goes with the group under orders of his father, King Kijo Tagami. Can't go without coffee in the morning. Sounds about right. Also save. And now we have Byakuya, huzzah. Now we have someone who can actually do some good, decent damage. Jeez, so much walking. Excuse me, Prit. Ahem. <clears throat> Byakuya-kun, why do you have such a long garden? Ha, huh, I almost forgot how big this garden is. The answer, however, is simple. It's long so I don't have to see commoners running their mouths or doing common things as they usually do. And that doesn't make any sense, though. You live outside of a rich and well-built city full of nobles. Listen. What? I could hear them very close to me. See why the garden is so long? Ouch. You just got burned, Makotochi. <laughs> and I just did too. <laughs> oh, having Byakuya around is going to be very entertaining, isn't it? Oh, Prince Takami, my apologies. I would hope to God you did not make service to just pointing out the truth. I'm sorry, did you want double taxes? I'll be good. <laughs> that sent you to a comment. Um, uh. Hey, I'll have Pub. Let's see how this goes. I don't want anything. Oh, Prince Gummy, you should- Yes, I'm sure. Just give these two- <laughs> Also, I need to heal. Oh, he's not here anymore, Damn it. Oh, does that mean we can go to the other inn and get, like, a discount because we have Tagami with us? That would be great. Do I have enough money to go to the inn? Ooh. Are we at the magical healing house yet? Yes, you've done nothing but whine the whole way. Can you shut up? Hi, Mikan-san. Oh, it's good to see you again. With the... With the prince? Yes, and I feel like bashing my head against this deck so I can get these two morons a room already so I can move on without them dragging me down. Uh, I will. For the prince, I'll even make it on the house. Wait, Mikan-san, you don't need to... Cool, free stuff. Never mind. Yes, whatever. Hey, we got healed for free. Thank you, Biakia. <laughs> I hope I, I hope to see you again. Okay, let's just move on. I'm not bothered to speak to everyone, unfortunately. Yakiji, what does it say? The names of two criminals that have been pestering the Takami Kingdom for quite some time. It won't be around much longer, though. <sighs> oh, Prince Takami, isn't it such a lovely day out there? It's not as absolutely perfect as you are, though. You're a stunning radiant, not to mention. You, Saito. Care to explain why the prices have shot up past regular price since the week ago when I checked your store? Oh, uh, well, that's... I suppose the only thing you kept at regular, at regular price was that so-called biography you wrote of me. Don't think I haven't read that disgusting rack. You dare call yourself an author when you see it was good for business. I don't care. I don't give a damn about your business. Your business will jeopardize the econ economy of the Tagami Kingdom. Put the prices back or I'll be throwing you in the dungeon. Got it, you worthless waste of space. Fine. 
Thanks, Fiyaki Yuji. You act like I did that just for you. <laughs> Don't humor yourself. Now with better prices. Uh, I don't have that much money though. I might want to get that though. Another robe. That would be good for you as a hero. Get that and then I'll come back for the bronze shield. Once I get some more money. Because I am dirt poor. <gasps> yes, and now we have Miyakia. Fun times. Let's train him up a bit. Where do we go, though? Ooh, who's this? <gasps> I know who this is! Hey, you there. Yes! It's my girl! My precious child! Hmm? Already you insist with on getting us off track. Hang on, are you lost? No. Hey, I'm Yasuhiro Hagikure, dude. What's your name? My name is of no importance. Well, what are you doing out here? Merely looking around for something, but it is clearly not here. I must be going now. Farewell. Who was that? I'll tell you who that was. A waste of time. Get moving. Let's go follow her. Because that sounds like the greatest idea ever. I don't know if you can tell by my constant singing, but I love soundtracks. Especially the Dank Ruffle one, it's really good. Power of the Good. I need that gold. Sure you do. Any news on if these rocks are going to be moved anytime soon? Oh, no, Prince Kami, no news yet. We've tried mostly everything we can find. <laughs> this isn't that good. This is a bit, uh, you know, I think I could... No. <laughs> no. So we were discussing how to get rid of uh, those weird bays, mate, and then this strange girl coming to be a detective showed up. Hi, huh, I bet she isn't even really a detective. She'd like to see her try. Wait, that girl, she looks familiar. Dude, we know her! You do? Your Highness, is this... You go... If you call a five second meeting knowing someone, yes. If you have brain cells, no. Oh, I see, carry on. Brain cells? Stop using all those hard words. You are an ignoramus. Aw, oh, come on. If maybe we should talk with her? You're a stupid bother move. Hey, you should try this awesome thing. I yes, I hear we do really don't have time for that now. Oh, whatever. <gasps> item box. No! <laughs> Leave me alone. Let me get my item box in peace. Mr. St Mr. Stapler? What's that? Damn. Let's go talk to the mystery girl now. Damn it. Magic's out of the question, as these boulders seem to have a magic seal placed on them. Arrows wouldn't be able to face them either. There must be another... Mm hmm? Oh, it's you three. I'm busy right now. If you have a way to clear these boulders, if you have a way to clear these boulders, then we can talk. Ooh, ooh, pick me, pick me! What are you going to do? Smash that skull of yours into the boulders? It might work if it were filled up. However, yours is hollow, so that means it definitely wouldn't work. No, no, dude. I once heard some story about a warrior whom everyone called lazy and a loser. However, little did they all know, that lazy loser had a secret technique gifted to him by gods. This technique could slice giant boulders like this right in two just by using his sword and a little effort. People always called me lazy and a loser, so I totally got this. That would be one way to destroy the boulders, but such a story may be legend. Furthermore, it appears you're drawing a staff, which- Don't worry, lady, I got this. As you wish. 
You can do it, Yessie. <laughs> Makoto is so supportive and optimistic. I can't wait. Are you going to clear the boulders? Please do. Oh, this is going to be brilliant. Everyone's counting on me. This is my time to show Yaki Chi I ain't stupid. Yasuhiro style, imploding explosion! <laughs> Why didn't it work? It didn't even make a dent! Well, that was a complete waste of time. Nice, back to work. Now, if you would let me finish. You're wielding a staff. That's t the technique you described in the story was used with a sword. Do you understand now? Man, one up by the mystery girl and Byakuchi in one day. Today isn't my day. There's always next time. Yes, I'm sure there is. Now, please do not waste any more of my time. It's important that I make it to Moonlight Town, and if I don't clear these boulders... Hmm. Seems I'll just have to do my best. Alright, we'll stay over here waiting this. Oh my gosh. He's no more... <laughs> the girl. I love her. She's, like, one of my favorite characters. Ooh, the Yaku's doing a bit more damage now. For some reason. Well, let's head back to the village then, I guess. Great. Everyone does so much more damage. I love it. And now onto our walk back to things with battles. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Come on, we're almost there. Damn it. So yay, Biakia got to level two. Level two, level two. Um, uh, at least these battles go by, but I was gonna say at least these battles are going a bit quicker with Biakia with us now. Thank you, we made it. Brilliant. 